this is anti-journal video number three. Um, this week I've not actually managed to get that many pages done, I've just been so busy, you know, I've had to prioritise things, so I managed to get three pages done. Two are kind of quick ones, they didn't really need like a load of detail or anything added, they were just ones that I was able to sit down, chill and just just do. And then the other page is the one that I asked for your guys' help with in last week's video. So yeah, it's not going to be a very long video, just going to flip through. Um, some weeks might be like this. I do try and get at least five pages done a week, but sometimes that just won't be possible. I still want to share this with you guys on a weekly basis. So yeah, I'll do my best to get as many pages done, but some weeks it might just be a shorter video. Um, just sharing with you what I got done. So the first page I did was this page. So for this page the two prompts are this little one here and then also this one. So the one that I did was stamp. Um, I just got all of my stamps out, all of my inks, everything and just kind of went a bit crazy. After I finished it I kind of wished I'd gone with just black ink. This is probably one of the few times in my life where I kind of wish I hadn't gone so crazy with the colour. Um, I usually obviously love colour um, I love a lot of it, I love bright colours, but there was just something about this when I looked at it when I finished that I just wish I'd gone with just black ink. The next page I did was obviously your guys' comments. In last week's video I asked for you guys to post a comment basically saying whatever you want and putting for your anti-journal or something like that in the comments so I knew that that comment was to be printed out and then added in here. I did receive more comments than I thought I would so I did my best to kind of cram them all on. What I ended up doing was actually printing off this photo which I posted on Instagram and I stuck it on a piece of card and then I stuck the card to the bottom of the page um, and it's also got another flap here <laughs> coming off of it um, and then I decided to cover the whole page in your comments. So by having this photo here I still know what the prompt was. Also it had the prompt squash something here on the page but I think I've managed to do that. I have squashed as many comments on this page as I possibly could. I am going to do a little close up and slow down the video so you guys can see all of your comments on this page. Your comments were absolutely amazing. I felt so overwhelmed by how many there were. It was just so lovely to read through them all. You guys really make me smile and I have the best subscribers ever. Um, and now I have them somewhere so you know I can look back on them if I want to. If you can't tell the prompt that I actually did was this one which you can barely see anymore. It says fill with completely illegible handwriting. I have been working all morning on my accounts and that includes a lot of handwritten things and my hands were really like achy afterwards so I thought this was probably a good page to do today because my hands are just they're exhausted they're past it so anything that I do write probably wouldn't be able to be read anyway so what I did was I found a quote which I really love and I decided to just write it over and over and over didn't care just kind of went for it obviously I know what it says so if you guys can tell what the quote is then I have most likely failed. If you think you know what it is then please leave it in the comments below, I'd love to see what your guesses are. So yeah, those were the three pages that I got done this week. Like I said, it's just been a kind of go 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 week, everything has just happened. Hopefully I'll have a few more to show you next week. Let me know as always in the comments if you have any questions and I'll do my best to answer you. And also make sure you check out the description because I have links down there to where you can get an anti-journal. Thank you guys so much for watching, sorry it was such a short video but I hope you guys can understand and I will speak to you very soon.